Buying groceries is certainly a basic necessity, mm -hmm. but in Johnson, flooding forced them to go way out of their way for years just to get something as simple as sugar. At the grand opening of a new store today, Cat Villian Zoni found out what it means for the town. Shoppers are buying groceries in Johnson, an everyday chore that hasn't been possible in the town for more than two years. Yeah, it's huge for a community like Johnson. The, the grocery store was really our anchor business. Flooding back in April 2011 submerged the old Grand Union in water, taking out the town's only grocery store. Until Tuesday, residents had to drive miles to Morrisville just to get food. Can I have one of these? Thank you, you Thank you so much. Thanks for coming by. The property is owned by the Pomerlows, who invested to bring a grocery store back to town with improvements to help prevent some future flooding. They got help from grants and loans. Though mum on the total cost, they said the town needed that central point again. The people can shop, or they should, in downtown. And a lot of them get a, haven't got a car. Five miles away is a long way, you know. And inside the store, owner Mike Como says he tried to cater to the diversity of desires and price points in the community when stocking the shelves. You know, I could put a store anywhere, but I really look for the, the community stores. I'm not interested in, in being sort of owning a store and a major highway where you don't see the same customer twice. It's more about coming and being part of a local community and really bonding with everybody here. The grocery store isn't the only thing new in town, though. Efforts were underway well before the flooding to revitalize Main Street here. And town officials say that after more than a decade of planning, securing financing and construction, the street has emerged more vibrant than before. We've heard from businesses that business is, is picking up. Um, it was a real tough two years when we had the construction project. Now that it's behind them, with spruced up streetlights, sidewalks, and infrastructure, the town is hoping for growth. Johnson's open for business. Um, you know, we're, uh, we're really looking uh, for anybody that's interested in coming here. We think it's a beautiful, vibrant community, um, has a lot to offer. A downtown renaissance where a new store is just the latest step. All right, and now the town's supermarket. Cadvillian Zoni, Channel 3 News, Johnson.